Did you know that you can have a fully functioning WordPress website in less than a minute? Let me show you how. So over here, I'm going to click on add new, click on create site. And just like that, I can now click on magic login. And this is happening in real time, by the way. And just like that, in less than a minute, in fact, it's less than 30 seconds. The service that I'm using is called Insta WP. So let's take a look and see all its features and how you can use this to create amazing websites. So I'm back over here now on Insta WP. As you can see here, my website has been created. If you want to log into your website at any point, all you have to do is to click here on magic login, or you can come over here on this a little arrow here and click on auto login and this takes you into your website because come on remembering this username and password every time and using this in a password manager no nah, no nah, that's a no no now with this everything is all managed on this particular website which is fantastic now let's take a look at other features so you know when i started off this tutorial i went over here and clicked on add new now there's a ton of features here there are cases where you may want to uh, install a wordpress website but with default plugins. This is where this dashboard comes in. So when you take a look at this, the first thing here we have is SEO press. So let's say you want to build a website with SEO. You can just come over here, click on SEO, move on to the next tab. So this time it's about security. Perhaps maybe you want to have WordFence. I can click on that. Now moving on, we also have social media here. Um, I'm not really keen on TikTok feed, so I'm gonna leave that. So I wanna keep on moving here and choose what I really like. Now I use this plugin called WP Optimize. So again, I'm gonna select that, come over here to forms. Now every website needs a form, so uh, I can choose now a form that I can add onto my website when I complete this install. But I'm gonna leave this for now and come over here to backups. I don't really need backups. Page builders, now this is very interesting as well. Instead of just loading WordPress, uh, Gutenberg, you can also install the basic install of Elementor, Breezy, uh, Gutenberg, and so on. So I'm gonna go with uh, Elementor for this one here. Now let's move on to marketing. Now over here we have WP Fusion. We also have drag and drop sales funnel. Now this is WP Funnels. So this is a quick way of creating a website that does funnels. So again, I'm gonna select that and also the email. Now moving on, we also have e-commerce, you have utilities here. So as you can see, we have quite a lot. We can choose them from the list. So it saves you so much time as compared to uh, installing a brand new WordPress website and then installing these plugins one by one. So let's say you're ready. You can give your site a name here. I'm just gonna call this uh, Mac test. I uh, hopefully that name is available. Now here's another feature. You can actually reserve this website because automatically if your websites um, are over a certain time it, this system automatically deletes them so if you want to reserve this you can reserve it by clicking on, on this little icon here now i'm going to leave that for now and now i'm going to click on create site so this is going to create my wordpress website with all those plugins and also my page builder so there we go now let's click on a magic login so now let's see if all our plugins have been installed, but I can really see that some of them have been installed. We can see WP funnels here on the bottom here. We have WordFence, WP optimize SEO and so on. But uh, to see the whole list, I'm going to come over here to plugins and then click on installed plugins. So you can see here we have Elementor, we have email marketing automation, SEO press, optimize press, WP funnels and so on. So this has saved me a lot of time and I really, really like this feature. Now let's move on and let me show you another feature that is really, really, really cool. So when you have all your websites here on the list, you can see here it has time to expire. Now at any point, you can come over here and reserve the site using this little icon here. Now, as I mentioned before, if you want to log into your website, you can just click on this little icon here to auto log in. This saves you from remembering the password and username and so on. And this is all happening from one central place. Okay, so let's take a look here at save template. So let's say I want to use this website that I've just created over and over again for future websites. I want to have the default plugins each and every time. I can always come here and say, save template, and I can give this template a name. Now here in the description, I can give this a full description or I can just uh, add something that reminds me of what this website is about. Now, if you wanna share this template, I can come over here to shared, and that now allows me to share this template pretty much with anyone that I give the link to. 
Again, this is pretty cool, but I'm going to keep it private. And then here we have Insta template. Now I have to upgrade to install this. But anyway, for now, let's click on save. Okay, so now that it's saved, check this out. I'm going to come over here to templates. So here I have this one here, which is public. And I also have my private ones. Now we can see that the Mac test site is right here. I created a I created this a few seconds ago. So this is where I can go in here, click this plus button here to create a new site. Now this will have all those plugins all installed again, saving me a lot of time. Now the next feature I want to talk about is connect. So this is where you can uh, use this plugin to connect to your website, therefore creating all your staging websites. This is very, very easy to set up and you can actually go in and uh, stage your websites. So how this works is let's say you have your website, but you want to uh, work on um, some upgrades or some updates. This can be pushed onto a staging website. And then once you're ready, you just push it through and pretty much there's no delay or any time lost while you're updating your website. Now, let's say you want to connect or start hosting your website from Insta WP. What you can do is you come over here to this hosting tab, click on connect hosting, and we have these several uh, hosting companies here, and you can easily connect these, and pretty much your website is now on a hosting server. Now, all you have to do is to update the DNS, and you'll have your proper domain name working with this hosting. Now, the next feature I'm going to show you is super powerful, and this was not in Insta WP before, and this is the ability to sell your templates. Now, take a look here. So this is one of my shared templates. So what you can do is you can come over here and configure this and actually sell it. So this is a complete website. So if I come over here now to monetize, I can actually choose to make this paid, and you can set your price here. So let's say this is uh, $49. You can just add it like that. Click on update. Now there's also more features here. If you come over here to the sales tab, this will show you how much you've sold and so on over here on the store. Now this is your actual store. So you can say, I wish to agree and proceed. And this is where now you can go in and add all your information about the template that you've just created. And this is where you can go in, select all the categories. So you can see here we have agency, blog, business, and so on. So you can choose the right category that your template belongs to. Now, on the top here, we also have things like branding. So you can go in here and add your logo. You can add your subject line here for your emails. Uh, for the gallery here, you can also add some images for your template. And then we also have advanced options. Now here on the advanced options is where you can say site lifetime, four hours. You can go in here, change the hours there. And you can say collect uh, emails. You can choose what you need to collect here. So you can collect the name and email. This is required, but you can send uh, credentials to emails here, but you can disable that. But these two are basically on there because it is a good idea that when someone tries to uh, purchase, you have their details. Now over here, we also have um, other options like webhook and uh, redirect URL and so on. So as you can see, this is another opportunity that you can use to make money with Insta WP. So, so you can get your share link over here and here it is. I'm gonna copy that or you can just preview it like that. And right now I haven't added any graphics. That is why this looks very basic, but you can see there's a price here. You can click on buy template. There's a name, email address, and we can now, you know, purchase this using, you know, my card. Now, the reason why I think this is a fantastic idea is if you're paying a monthly fee uh, for using Insta WP, if you have now the ability to sell your templates, pretty much your subscription is covered by the templates that you sell. So this is really, really, really good. Now let's take a look at other features. So if I come over here now, let's take a look at our subscriptions. So if I click here on subscription, this is going to give us an idea of uh, my plan and pretty much what is going on. This is pretty much like a bird's eye view. So my plan here is the $29 a month. So you can see here that it renews on November the 14th. It's $29. My card is there and my sites here, I have a maximum of 25. But the cool thing, as I mentioned, is I can always get them deleted after I've done you know, um, after I'm done using it. Now here we have the disk storage as well. You can see I'm pretty much far off getting close to my maximum here. Now back over here on my account, 
You can also enable two-factor authentication by uh, enabling it over here, which is very good if you want to really secure your account. Now you're probably thinking this is a basic service which does not have a lot of features. Now let me show you something very interesting. If I come over here to the top, click on this drop down, I can go to integrations and this now can be integrated to say for example MailChimp, uh, Active Campaign, and pretty much a few of these. So if you use Active Campaign, you can just come over here, activate it, add your API key and API URL and so on, and pretty much this connects with your uh, active campaign. I'm pretty sure that this list is going to be extended. Now back over here as well, uh, we can take a look at our configurations. Now these configurations are very important because this allows you to choose what version of PHP or what version of WordPress you wanna work with. So if I click here on this drop down, you can see we have our latest 6.3.2, but let's say you want to work with 6.2.2, you can just set that and then click on set. Your PHP version as well, you can come over here and choose whatever version you want and also these customizations. Very, very powerful. Now back over here as well, there's a few things that I wanna show you. There's also my apps here. I can also add to uh, Google Chrome, I can add to Slack, and I can also add to, add to WordPress. Now this is a very, very powerful service. So the question now is, who should use this service, InstaWP? So if you're a content creator and you're creating tutorials around say WordPress or any other plugins, this is a fantastic service because you are able now to deploy websites super fast, saving you a lot of time. You don't have to go into your um, web hosting account and create them or create them locally on your computer. Next, freelance designers. Again, this is super powerful for freelancers because you can create all your websites for your clients and once they approve them, you can just um, package that website and install it on your client's server. But it makes it very, very easy for your clients to see the progress of uh, their websites and so on. Agencies. Again, super powerful. You can have your team logging in and seeing all the progress of the websites that you're working on all online in one central place. Insta WP, in my opinion, is fantastic and I highly recommend it. Now, I have a link in the video description below. You can use that to purchase it and I'll really appreciate it if you use my link. All right, guys, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.